Hi everyone! This is a video about a new handheld digital oscilloscope from Cycland. It is an SHS 810 model with 100 MHz bandwidth from SHS 800 series. Let's have a look at the product design. The front panel houses a 5.7 inch display, controls, multimeter input channels. The upper side houses the oscilloscope input channels. The right side charging device connector and the mini USB port under the cover plug. Apart from PC synchronization, it serves as a calibration signal generator using a special adapter. The back support stand allows placing the device on the table. The battery compartment is situated under this stand. Battery operation time is 4 hours. The transportation handle is located on the left side. So you may hold the scope in the left hand and use controls with the right one. Now let's have a detailed review of technical specifications of this device. Cycling SHS 810 is a representative of a brand new series SHS 800. It has a bandwidth of 100 MHz. There is also a 60 MHz model in this series. The rest of the parameters are common. Maximum sample rate is 1 GHz. Oscilloscope memory is 32 KB. This portable oscilloscope has a built-in multimeter function. The continuation of the SHS series is an SHS 1000 oscilloscopes with an extremely useful but rarer feature of the insulated channels. Now it's time to have a closer look at the features of our scope. The device uses key type controls, including the gain factor keys, horizontal and vertical offset keys, horizontal sweep controls, and trigger level controls. Press the cursor measure button to enter the cursor measurements menu. You may select manual, track and auto mode. Press the same button again to open the auto measurements menu, where you may choose a measured parameters list to be displayed. For example, we set all 32 parameters to be displayed on the screen. Using the menu functional button, you may hide the system bar. You may change the screen color scheme to a more common one. The trigger menu allows choosing the trigger condition, including edge, pulse, video, slope, alternative. Trigger source and other parameters. User button activates system settings. You may set the date and time View the system info, enable and disable the button's sound, change the language, perform self-calibration, firmware update and more. Waveform saving and reproducing is performed similar to that in desktop SDS 1000 models. The channel menu allows to invert the signal. Activate one of the digital filters.
select the channel coupling, probe attenuation ratio and other parameters. Let's use the multimeter mode. As the multimeter function is additional in this device, it is not as convenient in use as a separate multimeter. However, you may use Sigland SHS110 instead of multimeter to measure the following. AC and DC voltage, resistance, capacity, check diets and continuity. The device provides the functions of relative measurements, switching between auto and manual range selection. One more interesting feature, you may view the measurement results as a timing waveform. Now we are going to test the oscilloscope operability using the test signals with a peak-to-peak -peak signal of 8 volts. 1 kHz sign. One hundred kilohertz sign. One megahertz sign. Ten megahertz sign. Twenty megahertz sign. 1 kilohertz square wave 100 kilohertz square wave 1 megahertz square wave 2 megahertz square wave 3 megahertz square wave 5 megahertz square wave 400 kilohertz ramp waveform Finally, have a look at the package contents. Apart from the scope, the package includes a user manual and a CD with easy scope software, probe calibrator adapter, charging device, Multimeter probes, USB cable, oscilloscope probes, as a conclusion. We want to mention that Cyglin company managed to create one of the best handheld oscilloscopes on the market, with characteristics compared to those of desktop models. At the same time, the price is competitive.